Okay, long time no see with the golf carts. We have the 2008 Easy Go TXT golf cart with the gas motor. So you can see it's been sitting for quite a, uh, probably a couple months. And we have the, of course, the Kawasaki Robin motor gas. It is carbureted. As you can see, we're very low on gas. And uh, we are gonna show you how well or not well it will run in cold temperatures uh, so today is about 29 degrees and uh, not too much wind which is good but you can see it is covered in snow and uh, the snow shouldn't be an issue especially once we clean it off but the cold will i drove this last time probably two months ago and it was about 41 degrees and don't know if it was just from sitting or what, but it did not like it too much. It didn't run as smooth and as powerful as it usually does. So we're gonna test it out today. And then if it runs bad, we're gonna throw some fresh gas I just got, see if that helps. My rear end is about to get really cold, but uh, that's okay, you know? Okay, so <laughs> obviously there is no defrost on this thing either. Let's turn the key on. So we uh, will definitely pull the choke out right here as we would with any cold start on this. I'm gonna put it in reverse because I can't really go forward. We have the beeper on, so I'm assuming we still have decent uh, voltage going on. And as you can see, we are just barely getting any, um, barely getting revs here, so it's not revving up like it should be it's not propelling us backwards so we're gonna pump the gas we're gonna mess with the choke as well in and out let me see if i can get this thing revved up oh, i don't know if you could see that black smoke there this thing just had a major backfire. It was actually kind of cool. <laughs> but we're getting some revs, so let's see if we can get some get some movement. We are. Okay, we're getting movement. But this thing does not like the cold. course we are not getting traction but I will use this opportunity to kind of give the motor some rpm that way we can generate some heat because this carburetor does not like the cold this thing reeks like gas right now okay at least our um, gears and transmission are working as they should it's going right into gear okay now for the sake of the video um, at this point Everything's frozen on this thing. Um, I will throw some fresh gas in it. I don't think it's gonna do much because, well, quite frankly, it is really cold for this thing. And uh, of course it's been sitting and we're not really gonna be able to go anywhere anyway because of the deep snow. So um, I will check back when we're filling it up. Uh, just maybe a gallon of fresh gas and we'll see if, uh, see if it helps. Well, okay guys, we just gave her about a gallon and a half of fresh gas. I'll go ahead and tighten it up. As you can see, the fuel filter is still clean. It's not real clogged. It was changed in December of 19, so just over a year old. That's not bad. Everything looks um, honestly pretty decent under here. Battery is in good shape, not corroded. So we'll go shut that up. We'll put our gas can, our handy dandy gas can back in the truck uh definitely have to cycle some new gas in first okay maybe reverse nope our headlights working though huh here we go here we go folks if I can stick to these tire tracks from the truck, we might be good. Alright, we're 
driving in the winter in a gas golf cart, huh? Nope, <laughs> not enough speed. Okay, we can back up. Let's hope guys I don't get stuck. That would be something. And speak of the devil. <sighs> well, that's not gonna happen in gear. Here is neutral, by the way. There. Yep. We're neutral. <sighs> Well, at least I, I know I can kind of uh, push and pull it. Not the easiest job in the snow. Okay, guys, we do have good news. I bet you can tell that that sounds way better, way smoother, way more power. So the engine is warmed up. And the new gas certainly helped. But as you can see, <laughs> It's been about 10 minutes since that last clip. I have had to make my way here in reverse. And I can't, there's a hill right here, like a little bump, and I'm having trouble. So let's see what we can do. Might as well show you on video. There's nothing more fun than watching some goofball I'll try and mess with this, mess with this stuff in the snow. Ugh. Here we go. See, now I have more power. <laughs> which means I actually spin more. It's harder to get traction. Although I love the way it runs. It's fun to drive when it, uh, when it runs good like this. That when it's down on power, it's rough. Now I got feather the gas. Come on, baby. Dang. Okay. We're gonna try driving down there and come up frontwards and forward. Okay. Come on. Give me some traction. No way. What are we getting caught on right here? Yep, that's pretty... Big bump. Okay, we're gonna have to go. We're gonna have to go straight and turn around somehow. I don't know how. This spot's not working. Oh my god. Gas golf cart that's been sitting for a couple months. She's doing all right. Okay, nice, nice and easy. I gotta turn around somehow. I don't know how. Wish me luck. Gotta make this like a five point turn. So I have to stay in the pack down snow. I can't go in the fresh snow. Okay, here we go. Here we go, baby. Yeehaw. Oh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna power right through this. Come on, baby. Come on. Oh, yeah. I am fine with that. This thing's a champ. This thing is a champ. It did it. Didn't have to tow it all the way back there to all the way up here. 
not bad okay guys so in conclusion we have the 2008 easy go golf cart gas will it run in the cold and i guess will it run in the snow yes it will it has to be warmed up first and even a couple months old gas will not work you have to have fresh gas you have to just wait and let that engine warm up and it will run below freezing but it is very temperamental obviously the carburetor does not like the cold um for electric i don't know i couldn't tell you i've never had an electric cart uh i don't think it would be very good in the winter and uh, obviously would not like the cold probably wouldn't last long at all so like my other videos i've actually done well on this channel i do prefer gas carts all the way if you're looking at a cart do your research um i think for most of you gas will work better it lasts long uh you barely have to maintain it compared to electric cart and uh you have versatility even in the cold weather so throw a like on there for that easy go gas golf cart that was fun kind of ridiculous you get to watch some idiot get stuck in the snow and uh, make sure to subscribe for awesome content across the board anything with a motor any tips i have i will post so thank you very much guys and uh i'll catch you later <laughs>